SP. But there's more headache for the centre because West Bengal Chief Minister Mamta Banerjee has levelled fresh charges against the National Investigation Agency. While addressing an event in the Nadia district, Mamta said NIA is fueling communal tension in the state of Bengal. She further added that strict vigil must be kept to ensure arms do not get transported in VIP cars in the name of VIP protection. The BJP has hit back at Mamta Banerjee saying arms being recovered and factories are being raided by the NIA and central agencies are showing the true colours of the West Bengal Chief Minister. बंद करते कारोबार हो रहा है और मुख्यमंत्री के नाक के नीचे हो रहा है आए दिन अगर बम फुटते हैं जिसमें छोटे छोटे बच्चे मारे जा रहे हैं क्योंकि वो बॉल समझ के बम से खेल रहे हैं तो इन सब चीज की जिम्मेदारी किसको उठानी चाहिए लॉ एंड ऑर्डर जो है वो स्टेट सब्जेक्ट है हर वो एजेंसी जो इनके काले कर्म को उजागर करे हर उस एजेंसी के विरोध में बोलेंगी मुख्यमंत्री क्योंकि देखिए चोर कहीं और नहीं उनके मन में और उनके घर में ही है तभी ईडी खराब है कभी सीबीआई खराब है कभी एनआईए खराब है कभी एनएचआरसी खराब है तो इनके लिए तो हर एजेंसी ही खराब है द एक्ट ऑफ एंड स्टेटमेंट ऑफ वेस्ट बंगाल सीएम शोज दैट शी डजेंट वांट एनीवन टू एंटर हर टेरिटरी शी डजेंट वांट इवन द यूनियन गवर्नमेंट टू कम एंड इन्वेस्टिगेट एनीथिंग इन हर इन वेस्ट बंगाल दिस एटीट्यूड इज नॉट गुड फॉर द नेशन फेडरल स्ट्रक्चर and nia if they have they have got some uh, links and they have got some evidences with regard to the involvement of some terrorists terrorists in the entire incident they want to enquire what is wrong in enquiring about it joining me on the broadcast shagoto mukhopadhyay shagoto politics aside the charge against national investigation agency is sensational it's the primary agency for anti terror probe they are being accused of smuggling in arms and ammunition on what basis is the chief minister making this charge well first up if you uh, look at uh, what mamta banerji has uh, said uh, very carefully um uh, she has not leveled any such charges against the nia of transporting arms and ammunition she uh, uh, she has obviously made the same charge uh, against some vips uh, not specifying who these vips are uh the vip cars which which make movement uh within the uh, uh within the uh, uh, you know the territory of of west bengal uh, obviously uh, the uh, the the oblique reference is to the bjp leaders who move around with uh, with central security forces um as part of their security detail and the charge is that uh, you know uh, that uh, yeah, arms and money are being uh, smuggled into sensitive areas uh, where uh, you know uh, communal violences are reported from uh, and and uh, she has advised uh, the, the police to be vigilant about it as far as the nia is concerned the statement that she made is some uh, places where uh, these uh, uh, these cases are being reported from uh, the nia is also moving into these places and, and we know all about it is what mamta banerji says exactly what she means by that is subject to interpretation it is uh, uh, the jury is out on that um, but even if we um, uh, you know take that as a serious charge it could mean that mamta banerji may have referred uh, to uh, to nia exceeding its brief of probing uh, you know uh, terror cases uh, whether she has actually said that only she can be uh, she can clarify hmm. uh, but because the statement is a little fake 
the statement is little oblique. Uh, we, uh, you know, it is it is difficult for us uh, to actually interpret it. Uh, you know, the way uh, what she exactly meant by that. Hmm. Uh, but uh, yes, uh, this has definitely led to a political war of words, uh, which we've been hearing uh, since yesterday. And in a state like West Bengal, uh, which is bound for another polls at the rural at the rural level, the rural body polls are due in the next two to three months. Um, now the entire focus of the political parties uh, are there in that uh, in that region uh, in the in the countryside of Bengal. Uh, you can uh, you can rest assured that such political war of words will continue uh, to uh, to to um, uh, you know uh, be traded uh, as far as uh, the the ruling Trinamool Congress and the opposition, especially the BJP, is concerned in the uh, you know weeks and months ahead. Right, uh, but very quickly, Shagoto, while you're saying that Mamta Banerjee was uh, careful when she was choosing her words, but the BJP is attacking her, have you managed to speak to the state level investigators? Anything that they have found uh, in terms of evidence to support this charge of arms and ammunition being ferried in from outside uh, to, to belittle uh, the local government? Well, uh, uh, you know, there are, uh, uh, you know, no concrete cases of the police having recovered arms and ammunition from VIP cars. Of course, there have been m many recoveries from uh, from cars uh, belonging or, or uh, owned by spurious, um, uh, you know, elements in the days past. Uh, we do know that, uh, you know, three Jharkhand MLAs uh, were stopped by the Bengal police some time back and cash was recovered right. from their cars. Mamta Banerjee claimed that those that cash was yes. uh, being smuggled uh, to to uh, to use uh, the the to topple the uh, Hemant Sorin government yes. in 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 Jharkhand. So those claims uh, have been made, but as far as uh, you know, moving car moving okay. uh, arms and cash in VIP cars, we do not have any concrete evidence of right. that. All right, Shagotha Mukhopadhyay, there getting us perspective about the charge being made by Mamta Banerjee. Waiting to see if MHA reacts, but for now, let me take. You